Hi all, it's Susan Winter here. Welcome back to my channel, YouTube subscribers. I love my family of YouTube subscribers. All of you are fabulous. If this is your first time listening, I hope you hear something you like. I am continuing with the video requests. This topic today is that very odd moment where you've been dumped. Okay, that's one level of it's not fun. And then you're told, because I'm going to hurt you. What's that about? What are the different layers underneath it? How do you read it? Do you take it seriously? Do you run? Do you stay? Here's what happens. And thank you for this. This came from Ashley. Ashley, thanks a lot. So Ashley writes, Hi Susan, I had a girlfriend for a month and everything about our relationship was great. She told me I was the only one who cared about her and that she doesn't want to lose me. Then, she told me she was going to hurt me somehow, so chose to leave me. It was sudden and weird. Why are people so indecisive these days? I don't really get it. Well, yeah, you and me and everybody else. What happens is sometimes people start down the trail of dating. She met you maybe socially, you met online, and they really were not intentional in what they're doing and things escalated. And the good news about this is part of this is true. I don't think it's a blow off. I don't think it's just an excuse. I think it's actually a fact that this person recognized in you that you're a good person. And she really didn't want to hurt you because she knew you were already emotionally invested by saying that you cared about her. She knows this, right? And maybe she doesn't have this all the time. And you are a good person, so she tells you about what she knows of herself. I'm going to hurt you. And what that is code for is, I'm going to hurt you because one, I really didn't mean to be in a relationship and your relationship material, and I don't have the headspace for this. Two, I've been terribly hurt. I am completely closed down. And I kind of think I do not have a skill set to be in a relationship. And you're a nice person and I still don't want to hurt you. Or three, it could be that 10% chance that I really like you and I am terrified. You are the person who could hurt me. And because of that, I'm going to preemptively bail and tell you that I don't want to hurt you. But if you're getting all excited and thinking, oh, let it be door number three that they really like me and maybe there's a chance. No, you can't play this out in slow-mo forward because what happens is when you have a person that's that boxed up and they have that many issues that they would think to push away a love, that they find a good person that actually cares for them. Oh yeah, this is the one I'm going to push away. They have so many internal issues and battles that they are fighting that your road with them, that journey is going to look like this. It's going to be up and down, hot and cold, in and out. You will not have a peaceful journey. You will not be able to secure the love that you want. I don't think it was intentional. And I do think that oftentimes, as confusing as daters are out there, sometimes they're telling us the truth. At least they're telling us what they know about themselves. So I hope this has helped you. Susan Winter for SusanWinter.net. Please, if you'd like to work with me, I would love to work with you. There are a couple of different ways that we can work together, a couple different packages. Please sign up for my newsletter on the homepage. That's where I tell you more specific things that are going on and I can reach out to you personally, make special offers that I can't do here. Thank you very much. If you want to write to me with your video request, go to the contact page of SusanWinter.net below media. We trash it if it's not me. Media, go to the box that says video request and we'll take a look at it. Thanks a lot everyone.